Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We did it. We knocked out 2022-23 Upper Deck Opeechee Platinum Hockey. Four box, random team break number one. One spot gets you two random teams. And for tonight only, we're going to give away three random team spots. Uh, no vet common ship, one autograph, some retro, a lot of parallels, a lot of fun stuff. Chasing after this guy, among others. Big thanks to this group. So we only sold 13 spots outright of the 16. And we're going to give away a few spots. Top three after three and a three. Six the hard way. One, two, three, four, five, and six. All right, congrats to David, Ryan, and Steven. Steven's happy about this hockey selling out. He was here earlier. Let's go. So let's get your names in there. Congrats. We'll put little rooftop symbols next to your name so that way you can know that, that those are your winning spots. Now let's gather up those names right there. Double them up. Oh, double up. Oh, oh. And then let's randomize you a hockey team. No combos. So there should be 32 items on each list. Let's randomize each list five into two, seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And then five into two, seven times for the hockey teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven, we have the Flyers down to the Rangers. Now, quick thing here, I do like, Upper Deck gives us like a little little stand right here that talk, talks about key rookies. So we're looking for Kraken, Wild, Blue Jackets, Duck Sabres apparently are the top rookies ever chase, chasing. Matty Beneers, Kraken, Matt Boldy, Wild, Kent Johnson, Blue Jackets, Mason McTavish, Ducks, Owen Power, Sabres. So if you're uh, not too familiar with hockey, you can keep those teams in mind. All right. Ronnie, you got the Flyers. Steven with the Panthers. David with the Canadiens. Jack with the Lightning. Jim Way with the Hurricanes and Blackhawks. Kevin, Blue Jackets. They're on the list right here. Ryan with the Sabres. They're on this list. Bennett with the Avs. David with the Coyotes. Ryan with the Red Wings. Jason with the Stars. Jim Way with the Canucks. Bennett with the Oilers. Uh, Ryan with the Flames. David with the Penguins. Jack with the Islanders. David, you got my Kings. Bennett with the Maple Leaves. Jack with the Preds. Steven with the Golden Knights. Kevin with the Kraken. It's a nice draw for Kevin. He has the Kraken and uh, what? Another team, Blue Jackets. Uh, Ronnie with the Bruins. Steven with the Caps. Jason K, Last Spot Mojo, Minnesota Wild. Look for Matt Boldies. Uh, Sharks for David. Bennett with the Blues. Jim Way with the Devils. Ryan with the Ducks. That's another one of the, the key rookie cards on this card right here. David with the... So Ryan with the Ducks. David with the Senators. Jack with the Jets. And Steven with the Rangers. So it's alphabetized by team. And we're going to pause the video just for a little bit. And when we come back, because that's going to be the trade window, when we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. And then we'll have the break. So stick around. Be right back. Oh, just a quick. There it is right there. 2022-23 is what we're looking for. There you go. Thanks, Upper Deck. Uh, thanks, everybody. We're going to pause the video. We'll be right back. We'll see you on the other side. All right. Welcome back to the other side of the trade window. No deals were done. So TWC trade window closed. Jason K, last spot mojo with the stars and wild 70% of the time, 100% of the time. And there's the rest right there. Thanks everybody. Here's a fresh case, so Peachy Platinum. Hopefully that sticker is right. Eight boxes, second half in the store. On oh, the bottom of the box, no Peachy Platinum. <coughs> Excuse me. Now Blake Snell, maybe six years, 105 mat. I don't think. I don't think teams want to give him the years. Not for Snell, I mean.
All right, so we got four boxes on the left side, four boxes on the right side. We'll go one, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side, and it's one. So we'll do the left side right here. This side, we will save for break two. So we'll put some X's right there with a Sharpie so you know that they're from the same case. And for tonight only, we'll run back that three extra spot promo. So if there's some hockey fans out there watching right now, why not, why not strike while the iron is hot and we can run back that second half tonight? Right, yeah. I mean, that's that's the silly season, Rex. I guess it's not really off season anymore, but this is going to happen with with the NFL too. I think the free oh, that's right. The free agent window opens uh, before the draft window for the NFL, so you're going to see a lot of you know a lot of diversions, a lot of front office versus player agent tactics that are going out. Yeah, silly season should be over, but I mean, that's what Scott Boris has to do. He's got to be like, yeah, there's teams that are interested, and you try to leverage that to get the best deal, best deal possible for your client. You know, and really, the agent works for the client, right? If Blake Snell wanted to be like, all right, let's, you know, forget it, Scott, let's just sign the, I think Blake Snell's. Sports Blake, Blake Snell's agent, right? You know, Blake Snell, if he's just like, all right, hey, listen, I'm eager to work. Like, just let's just get a deal. Let's just get the best short-term deal possible or whatever. Let's get it done. Put me in camp. But as long as he's not directing that, you know, maybe Blake Snell's saying, hold out. Let's get the best deal possible. And maybe he's looking at that, maybe he's looking, you know, John was mentioning he's going to get 3 and 78 with two year opt-outs, which is, which is what Bellinger did, which is what Matt Chapman did with the Giants. You know, and there's that short-term deal Zach Wheeler got, so I don't know, does that set the, does that change the, uh, does that change the, math for Blake Snell. I'm going to keep this key rookie card thing next to me here. And there's Quinn Power. Owen Power, that is. This is one of the guys, right? 101 out of 149. Yeah. Well, he's on the key rookie cards list here. Buffalo! That'll be for Ryan and the Buffalo Sabres. Nice aquamarine. 101 out of 149. Buffalo? Buffalo! Wait till Buffalo, wait, wait till a gold card comes out for the Buffalo Sabres. Buffalo Gold? Your favorite slot machine? And we got Chase Pearson, Detroit Red Wings. That's gonna be for Ryan P. Hold Autographs de Recu. Recu? Then I've never. Didn't take French. Did not take French. There's Sunset, Jack McBain, Burn. Yeah, I wonder who's going to give. Uh, Who's gonna give Trevor Bauer a shot? I don't think he's under. I don't think he's under any any restrictions anymore. There's hot magma, liquid hot magma. Two ninety seven out of four ninety nine for the Golden Knights. Zach Hughes, Zach Hayes, not Hughes. That'll be for Vegas. That's gonna to go to Steven. There is a Drake Batherson, 212 out of 349, liquid metal. These are kind of cool looking parallels here. 
Although this kind of looks like this. I guess now I look at it, it is magma, but like almost a giraffe print at first. There's a um, Maddie Brenier's insert. There's sweet selections. Matt Benier. There's Oscar uh, Olausen, 189 at 299 for the Avs. That's going to be for Bennett. And this is another one for Seattle, Kevin. Now these are inserts, but they probably aren't as valuable. But let's try to find like a proper base card, maybe a. I think Philip Deneau had a had a hat trick the other night for the Kings. <coughs> let's see if we can find some some color for the Kraken. <coughs> Excuse me, voice is starting to go already. Now there's Philip Kurashev, 345 out of 499 for Chicago. That'll be for Jim Way. Got Dawson Mercer, Arctic Freeze, 67 out of 99 for New Jersey. That'll be for Jim Way. Got Mark Stone, Sunset. Yeah, what a season Austin, Austin Matthews has been having. There's Owen Power, another Owen Power, Matt Pink this time. Buffalo! That's for Ryan and the Buffalo Sabres. Yeah, I mean, I feel like there's Mitch Marner for the uh, the Maple Leafs. I don't, I don't think Trevor Bauer is going to get signed until maybe the middle of the season. That's just my guess. I feel like there'll be, I feel like there'll be a team that, you know, that has a key injury, you know, maybe a playoff team with a key injury, a, a big need in the starting rotation, and they'll they'll sign Bauer for half a season. Why don't we, while I'm ripping packs here, you know, it's not too often I get to have a longer sort of leisurely hockey break where we can go through some hockey scores. The Blue Jackets beat the Golden Knights 6-3. to three. It's A little bit of an upset there. Uh, in a shootout, Blues end up beating uh, the Flyers 2-1. to one. Panthers beat... Uh, Beat the Rangers. Match of two good teams here. 4-2 to two in New York. Bruins beat the Maple Leafs 4-1 to one in Toronto. 18 minutes left in the third period. Looks like it just started. Kraken leading the Flames 3-1. And the Avs, uh, I think the third quarter is just starting maybe? Or is it over? Third period, that is. Abs are shutting out the Blackhawks, 5-0. Five, five Poor Connor Bedard. He's the, the, the hot rookie of the 2023 class. This is 2022, but... Um, I think I uh, busted his jaw or something like that. I 
You know, so... There's Nick Robertson, Houndstooth, 9 out of 15. Nice low number there. Toronto, Bennett with the Maple Leafs. And there's our autograph, Eric Calgren, Toronto Maple Leafs, Bennett. So here's a sweet selection going to Minnesota. That'll be for Jason K. Sunset and Pierre Luc Dubois. 492 out of 499, uh, Winnipeg edition, goes to Jack B. There's a, I don't, I've been trying to follow hockey a little more closely, but I kind of short on like sort of deeper backstory kind of knowledge. Pierre Luc Dubois, I, I guess is a controversial, he's on my Kings now, apparently he's a controversial player. Because he maybe has forced his way out of a couple places. You know, I've heard the word cancer being used, locker room cancer. You know, can switch on and off in terms of being engaged in the game. So we've, I guess I've kind of seen... Kind of seen this season, but I think after 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 Todd McClellan got fired, I guess they've been kind of better about things. It was Vladimir Tarasenko, three forty nine for the Blues. And there's Blake Wheeler for Winnipeg. That's going to be Jack B, 231 out of 299. Violet Pixels. Noah Dobson to 149. Aquamarine for the Islanders, Jack B. Alex Ovechkin to 199. Nice. That's a red prism. Steven with the caps. I feel like we haven't seen. Okay, I'm just trying to keep some of these names in mind. So obviously, I, I think these key the key rookies obviously will ship because uh, it's just no vet commons that don't ship. But obviously. Rookie cards will ship, so in case I missed any of those key rookies, don't worry, they'll still they'll still get to you. All right. Let's roll. I think the hockey season is close to wrapping up, right? Let's take a look at the... Uh, let's take a look at the standings here.
How do the is it the first? I don't know how the how the, how these work. Is it the first three in each each division, and then a couple wild cards in the conference? So in the Atlantic, Panthers, Bruins, Maple Leafs, and then Metropolitan New Rangers, Hurricanes, Flyers, Red Wings, and Lightning are your wild card teams. I think that's how it works. In the West. Winnipeg, Dallas, and Colorado in the Central. In the Pacific, it's Canucks, Oilers, and Knights. And the Kings and Predators are your current wildcard teams. Yeah, Ovechkin still, still scoring goals. I have, I have no idea who Ryan Bates is either, because that's why he's only a fifth round pick. Ovechkin, uh, born in 1985. I guess he's been in the league for a long time though. That's Kent Johnson. He's one of those uh, key players. Sweet selections. Columbus Blue Jackets. Kevin. And here is a... I don't know what this par premiere parallel. That looks pretty cool. Maddie Beneers, Seattle Kraken. Nice one for Kevin and the Kraken. And there's Zach Wierenski, 56 out of 65. Cosmic parallel, also for Columbus. And there's a base, Matty Beneers. And your autograph is Joe Pavelski. Dallas Stars. That's going to go to Jason K. Last Spot Mojo. Last Spot Mojo's been hitting a lot lately. Here's a red auto. Last Spot Mojo, 70% of the time hits 100%. It might be 75% of the time now. I mean, there was a time Last Spot Mojo was on a cold streak. We brought we brought Last Spot Mojo down to sixty percent at one point. Double O seven out of one forty nine. Jordan Carew, Aquamarine. Double O seven out of one forty nine. Do 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 do. Leon Dreisettal, Magma. Oilers, that's going to be for Bennett and Edmonton. That is uh, to $4.99. And there's Drew Dotty. Nice. For my Kings. 288 out of 299. David with the Kings. Miko Rantanen. There's Ole Likesell, 235 out of 299. I follow. This will be for Philadelphia. Ronnie with the Flyers. Brady Kachuk, Sidney Crosby, Hot Magma, 195 out of 499, Pittsburgh. David with the Penguins, the Penguins. All right, fourth and final coming up.
Second half in the store right now if you want to run this back, jazbeescasebreaks.com. We've got time to do it. Some powerful sh shrink wrap on this. Uh, Peachy Platinum. My Lakers up 55-43 on the Thunder, start of the second half. Not too many games on the basketball slate, but the Jazz beat the Wizards 127 to 115. Trailblazers kept it close. They only lost by five to the Timberwolves. Bucks beat the uh, Giannis less Bucks beat the Clippers 113 to 106. Clippers gave up 40 points to the Bucks in the fourth quarter. They only scored 25 in the fourth. And that's that. Grizzlies beat the Nets 106-102 in Brooklyn. Lakers up by 10. Up by, yeah, up by 10 after that missed free throw. And uh, Kings are leading the Bulls 91-77. to They just started the fourth quarter. Are the Wizards going to beat Detroit's losing streak? What's their losing streak right now? What are the Wizards going to do? I feel like, I'm, I'm not sure, who's running that organization out there? We got Alex I follow. For the Kings. LA Kings, David, that's 35 out of 50, seismic gold. Here's another uh, Matty Ice for uh, the Kraken. Kevin, yeah, he's on the ice. And a redemption behind Jakob Voracek. And it's uh, Lucas Dostal, Platinum Rookie Autograph. And he is a Czech ice hockey player, a goaltender for the Anaheim Ducks. And that'll be for Ryan. Ducks fly together. There you go, Ryan. That extra winning spot coming in handy for you there. Jordan Everly. And there's Marcus Bjork. 23 out of 149. Aquamarine. Columbus. It's going to be for Kevin. Ryan's at all. Bobby Brink, Matt Pink. I, I don't know if I could do that. 
Shane goes tis a Harry goes tips a Harry. But I'm going to work on that one. We got Zach Hyman, 470 out of 499. Edmonton, that's going to be Bennett. We got Jordan Spence, 303 out of 499 for the LA Kings. It'll be for David. Coming up on the end, Kurashev, Blake Coleman, liquid metal to 349 for Calgary. That's going to be for Ryan P. This is usually when the. Uh, and the last bit here. The Lakers start blowing it, right? Third quarter, yes, first and third. They, they, they love going down early in the first, coming back in the second, getting sluggish out of the first half, and then some mad comeback in the fourth. Sometimes it happens, sometimes they win, sometimes they don't. Two out of 99, Adrian Kempe for the LA Kings. And that, my friends, is the break. Four box of OPG Platinum. That was random team break number one. Second half in the store, jazbeescasebreak.com. Quick little recap here, not too shabby. There's some players that I recognize, so that's pretty good. That Hound's Tooth also really low number too, nine out of 15. So some pretty nice stuff. Thanks for watching, thanks for breaking with us. I'm Joe, I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.